Greetings, Grandfather. Now today I want to teach you a little bit about healing. I know this is something you all need at one time or another. And also it is something that some of you are helping others with even now in various professions. This is what I'd like you to consider and that's that plants and uh, trees have a great deal to do not only with their properties and uh, various herbs and so on involved with healing or even inspirations for formulas that have gone on to become medicines, but simply by being they can function in a healing capacity. So, this is something that might work better with trees, especially old, strong, sturdy trees. However, if you happen to have a yard or available to you a park where there is a sturdy group of weeds, certain weeds, as you know, are very, uh, how can we say, uh, assertive. Then you can also try it with weeds. Keep in mind that weeds are simply plants that you do not understand their purpose. That's it. You will understand some day. I'm not just talking to those who are not familiar with plants. I'm talking to people in general. For plants have a spiritual quality as well as a herbal or medicinal quality. So, without getting into that too much at this time, since uh, there'll be a book coming your way at some point through this being, published by Light Technology. For now, I simply want to recommend that you find a tree, you may already have one, that is a friend. It's a friend because you go to the tree and you don't go up and touch it. Even any of the low boughs or branches, you don't touch those. But you get close enough so that if you walked three or four paces farther, you could touch a branch, or in the case of a high branch tree, you could touch the trunk. That's the measurement to use. Then say to the tree, out loud or whisper if you prefer, good life. See if you can notice a good feeling in your chest. A warmth would be best, but a gentle good feeling would also be good. It has to come after you say good life. But if you have a warmth that's noticeable when you approach the tree, that also counts. After you say that, ask the tree, though the tree will not uh, respond verbally to you, if you can join the tree for a few minutes, wait and see. If you feel the warmth still, or that good physical feeling, then this is what I recommend. First say, out loud, I am asking that all those benevolent energies that are available for me and that are compatible with me and will be compatible with this tree be all around me and all about me now. Then pause for a moment. There might uh, be a very good feeling for many of you. There might be a warmth or an increasing warmth or increasing good feeling. After that passes a bit, it doesn't have to pass completely, but it passes a bit. Then say this, I am asking 
the tree and me now be merged in such a way that I am able to assimilate as much as would be good for me the wisdom of this tree and tree is able to assimilate from me as much as would be good for tree my wisdom both of us retaining our own and simply sharing with each other benevolently wait there might be a time that passes but there will be an energy a feeling or a warmth or a tenderness in your heart meaning something where you almost move to tears many of you oh yes trees have vast wisdom that goes beyond their own personal experience and the tree itself might move it won't jump up and down but you might notice if your eyes are open but you could have your eyes closed if you prefer and you might be able to feel the energy better if you do it's up to you if your eyes are open though you might notice the branches moving a bit trees can move on their own not just with the wind I don't know if you know that wait until all the energy you've been feeling fades or in the case of some of you if you feel weak in the knees because of the experience if you're not already sitting on the ground you can very slowly move so that you're sitting on the ground okay sit down someplace where it's safe if you happen to have a folding uh, wooden chair with you or something a camp chair made out of wood or canvas that's the best kind you can slowly settle into that or even start by sitting in that and when the energy and the feeling passes completely and you are completely relaxed then if your eyes are closed open your eyes and look at the tree with a newfound respect and very possible love then simply say again good life out loud or whisper whatever you wish then turning or rotating to your left rotate into the direction you need to face and walk on with your life this is a way to engage not only with wisdom but the wisdom of a tree might also be expressed in healing at a time when you need it or even cause an injury or a disease to be less harmful more about that another time good life